Yeah. So then they they do a very quick edit right to the worst act on TV, in my opinion, who's the greenest guy on television is Alex Marvez. Okay. And Alex Marvez <laughs> introduces it to his terror like he's we What's the best way to describe Alex Marvez? He's obviously green, but he's just a green and atro- atro- atrocious, right? Color, so he colorless. Introduces, yeah, colorless, overacting, overexcited. Joe Feeney. Bland, yeah. bland monotone. For, yeah. I mean, Joe Feeney Jr. Well, Joe is far more charismatic no, than Alex Marvez. No, he's not. Joe, Joe's a better actor than Alex Marvez. No, he's Marvez. not. Absolutely. No, he's not. Yes, You're giving him is. way too much credit. Thank so you. they introduced a guy from the, the internet, this Luigi Primo, the pizza wrestling guy. I love this guy. Wow. They should have left really? him on there more really? time. Uh, I think uh, I pop when I see him. It's atrocious. Funny. I think that is hilarious. <laughs> so Bro, he, this is how hilarious I think he, it is. I'm actually thinking because I think he lives in San Antonio, bringing him to a TJ show and see if he gets over. Oh, my God. Uh, Ethan Page quickly <laughs> just booted I'm him. Like, I love that. Yeah. Okay. And he said he's the only one that takes things seriously around here. Dan Housen walks into the scene and mouse off to Page and guess guess what guess what the whole purpose of the segment was to set up yeah. a match Challenge. right from Friday and Friday. Yeah. So was like, and this was all there were four people this Alex Marvez the I Pizza think guy. I finally I think I finally get Dan Housen and he is kind of an acquired taste I think he's supposed to be a guy that thinks he's evil but he's not right. and everybody's in on the joke but he's a terrible wrestler very nice guy because I have met him right. but I'm Kind of, start, I, I kind of popped a little bit for him this week, right? Uh, but this this whole segment, there were four people in it, and like it was like Luigi's over with me, dude. I don't care. Bro, what he you think, say. he was in, he said like one word. Was I on know the they for didn't four seconds. Right, they should have let him do the <laughs> th- right. because <laughs> That's a, bro, right. he actually right, gets, yeah. I've seen him in like a match, and they'll do like a arm, like he'll be with the pizza, you know, uh, right. doing the thing, and they'll do like a the arm ringer, right? And he'll keep doing the pizza thing, and then he'll get on his back, and he'll do it between his legs. And, bro, it's actually a funny act. And he should have done a little bit of that, and then he got super kicked. But the guy just barely said two words, and I, I thought they didn't get enough out of that. Right. Um, I'm just kind of thinking here. I was Because, like I said, I'm, you know, you, you like him. And so I'm going to yeah. give him a I, Bro, I would bring him I, to the ring I with don't... a chef's hat, with one of those rolling pins, with a, with a bag of dough, and the and the, and the pizza dough thing, bro. He would get over. I'm telling you. Yeah. Um. So I'm trying to think because I'm creatively around right now. I'm just thinking. Like, like you could do spots where, like, you know, all of a sudden now it's like certain wrestlers. You could do a promo with this. Like, they, they, guys are a bunch of guys are starting to eat. They're eating pizza backstage. <laughs> like the pizza guy. They got the pizza guy wrestler now. Like, guys, like, hey, what a pizza! Like, maybe the guy's delivering pizzas. Like, yeah. he could, bro. He could come out of the middle of a match and deliver a pizza. <laughs> right. Like, like, think about that, right? Like, yeah, like for a the, couple of weeks before he actually makes a debut. Like, say, like the bear, the bear country guys are, are in a match, right. and the pizza guy in the middle of the match comes out and delivers a pizza to them because they're fat. And they want to eat. They want, right. they want a pizza. <laughs> that would be a way they, to get the guy over. And it's easy right? just one day somebody doesn't pay him or tries to rip him off, and you know, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay, yeah. I mean, if you're gonna have a comedy act, you know, like it's here. I still think. They're completely miscasting their comedy characters. You could take Jay George and make him the comedy guy in your show, and he'd do be, he'd be better than all these guys. 